So we're going to make a contour map today, a topographic map. Now remember, the contours, the lines, show places of equal elevation. So we're making those on some mountains that you're about to build. Now make sure you have all of your materials. You need a marker, paper, some clay or play-doh, and a plastic bag. Now the plastic bag doesn't have to be like a food bag like this. It could be a big grocery bag. Um, so first thing you'll do is take your clay and push it down into one of the corners of the bag. So I've pushed it into this corner. Might have to squeeze it a bit and soften up your clay or your Play-Doh. I'm going to make a hill. So put it on the table so I can make my hill. So there we go. It's not a very impressive mountain, but it'll do. So then you'll take your marker and you'll draw your contour lines on that plastic bag. Now remember, a contour line shows places of equal elevation. So I'm going to do one mark at the top of my hill and then I'm going to come down and draw a line on the side and I'm going to do that line all the way around trying to keep my marker level. So it's marking places of equal elevation. And then I'll work my way down further and draw another circle, another um, contour line. And try and make sure your fingers don't end up smudging the lines you've already put on the bag. And then I'm going to do my bottom contour. So near the bottom of the mountain. But yeah. So it's not the prettiest, but hopefully this will work for us. So once you have your mountain with your contour lines, and hopefully you can see them on there, you're going to take it, hold it over the paper, and smoosh it down there. You want to smoosh it straight down, and you want to press it pretty hard to try and get the ink to transfer from the plastic bag onto the paper. So you can see the top of the hill, the first contour, the second contour, I wasn't very good at doing my third contour on there. But you can see that when you have a hill that's about the same slope all around, then the contours look like a bullseye. Well, this time I'm going to make a different hill. So let me squeeze all the clay or the Play-Doh back to one corner. And I'm going to make my hill this time so that it's steep on one side, but it's a gentle slope on the other. Can you see the mountain? This is what it looks like from above. So again, take your marker and draw your contours. And just like we did the last time, take it and we're going to smoosh it straight down onto the paper. So I'm putting my hill down there first and then smoosh. So where my steep hill was, my contours are close together. Where the gentle slope was, my contours are further apart. So remember, the contours are lines of equal elevation. So on the steep slope, we were changing elevation quickly, and that's why the lines are close together. On the gentle slope, it was taking us longer to cross those contours, and because the slope was more gentle. Good marker. Well, have fun. Happy squishing.